being robbed or murdered for the money. You never hear about them going into court to have it to endure family squabbles. I'll say without any doubt in my head, if I won that money, I would not give anybody any money. You know why? Because they weren't there when I won that ticket. And they sure as hell weren't there when I bought it. So the whole theory of, uh, what are you going to give your mother or father or your family when you win the ticket? Nothing. Is that being selfish? Yeah. Are they being selfish for assuming they're going to get money? Yeah. Does money change people? Lies, you will give me five. Five dollars? Alright. That's a deal. Where's this? Oh, hi, Jenny. How you doing? That's a verbal agreement, you know that, holy Jesus. Plus, it's been recorded by Twitch. Unless I delete the footage and block you, you'll never see me again. <laughs> Shit. Who's squealing? Whoa! Kill his way to hell over there. You know what would have been, you know what would have been real funny if you said tree fitty. I need about tree fitty. God damn it! I ain't got no tree fitty. You goddamn Loch Ness monster. <laughs> oh damn! That killer took him in the basement. Oh uh, shit! I said to Loch Ness monster, what you need? He said about tree fitty. Tree fitty. That's when I noticed Holy was one five feet tall and covered in scales. <laughs> I said, wait a minute, are you the Loch Ness Monster? He said, yes. I said, God damn it, Mr. Loch Ness Monster, why are you lying? Wow. There's a party going on in the basement, and I'm not invited. Totem? 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 Want to hear a funny joke? The late great Paul Mooney once said, he said, I got these white people as neighbors next door. This white woman, she got a kid. And one day she's making a chocolate cake. And when she wasn't looking, the kid took the chocolate frosting and put it on his face. He said, look, mommy, I'm black. The woman, she slapped the child. She said, you go and tell your father what you just did. So the kid goes and shows the father what he did. The kid slaps the kid. Now you go tell your grandfather what you just did. So, he goes to the grandfather. Grandfather slaps the kid. Now go back to your mother. And the kid go back to the mother. He says, now what did you learn? He said, mommy, I've been black for five minutes and I already hate all you white people. <laughs> now that's a funny joke. That's by the late great Paul Mooney who recently died from colon cancer. What a goddamn shame. The man wrote for Richard Pryor, wrote for Dave Chappelle, one of the most greatest unheard of comedians ever. That's a goddamn shame that he's dead. And Adam Sandler is alive. Bah! Now if that tells you ain't no God, I don't know what the hell is. Why do white people like Wayne Brady? White people like Wayne Brady because he makes Brian Gumble look like Malcolm X. <laughs> Holy 
Holy shit. That's fucking funny. And then Dave Chappelle does a bit on Wayne Brady being the baddest motherfucker on the planet. I'm Wayne Brady, bitch! Oh, shit. We both got the hell out of there. Let's go here to Brother Man. Brother Man, Brother Man. Uh, let's hear to Brother Man. Brother Man, Brother Man. We just going around healing each other, unhooking each other, nothing's getting done. We're doomed. Uh wait a minute. Does Wayne Brady got a joke a bitch? If you do not smoke this day, we have a problem. <laughs> I'm I'm trying to be a nice person. I'm is Wayne Brady gonna have to choke a bitch? <laughs> Ruffy and Rich! Ruffy and I bitch! Get some help! <laughs> he looks at Wayne Brady. It's <laughs> just, just, just a joke, man. I'm just joking. People were so pissed off when Dave Chappelle abandoned that show, man. Rightfully so. That was the funniest show since the Richard Pryor show. Dave, I didn't know you like to get wet. What you talking about, man? It's just some weed. No, man, it's got PCP in it. What you talking about? Sherman Hensley, Angel Dust. Watch this. Watch this. Where's he going? Oh, he's watching. Oh, shit, she died. Damn. Who's going to be next, folks? Who's going to be next? I haven't been hooked yet. Hmm. I must have a guardian angel looking out up for me. Oh boy, there goes Bill. That's his second hook. He's dead. Oh, there goes Looney Tunes. Ah, shit. I hate being a nice person. I'll save you, even though you're a dead man walking. How you doing, Bill? Come on. This doesn't appear what it is, folks. I'm healing him, okay? From this angle, I am not doing what you think I'm doing. I'm healing him. Yeep! We all gonna die! We all gonna die! We all gonna die! We all gonna die! Okay, you got the job. You got the job. You got the job. You got the job. There you go. Oh God, Bill, what are you doing? Come on, baby, do it. Do it, baby. Do it. There you go. Poor Leatherface. His job never ends. Let's see if this hook revives. No, the hook's right there, dude. Aw, the hook's right there. Oh, man. Leatherface has the body of Chris O'Neill from Oni Place. Where are you going? See if I can get off the hook. No? Lousy skill check. Skill check. Skill check. There's one. Come on. There's two. Come on. There's... Oh, man. Yay! He's going to get him. We're all going to die. It's going to be great. <laughs> oh, man. This killer. If this killer isn't a rank two, I don't know anybody is.
I see how there he is. Put him on the hook. Pick me up. Uh, let's. There he goes. There you go. Ah. I'll stay right here. I'll follow the killer. Let's see what he's up to. You gotta pick me up, man. You gotta pick me up, brother, man. I can't do nothing for you down here on the ground. I know, I'm going. I know. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle! Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle! Now that's weird. The hatch is actually on a second floor. You know what? I always said that Leatherface has a kind face. Like he wants him to die. Wiggle, 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 wiggle. Watch, he'll scoop me up and kill me. Watch. See, there he goes. Now he's gonna put me on the hook. I'm gonna die. See? Ah. Wiggle! I know, I can hear it. He'll kick it. Watch, he'll kick it closed. Kick it. Kick it. Come on. I'm no fool. Kick it closed. There he goes. <laughs> now he's gonna, he's gonna set me up on a hook. And... I'll go to the gate. Where's the gate? Where is it? I can't find the gate. Where is it? Ah, uh, you can take me to the gate or take me to hell. It's your choice, Bubba. Bubba, Bubba, Bubba. Ah, there he goes. All right. No hard feelings. But we both got blood points. We good. Did he really think I was going to escape through the hatch? No. There was never any doubt. But I did get the most points.